Land and Water of the Southwest Region. The Sonoran Desert and the Chihuahuan Desert make up a large part of land in the Southwest Region. The Sonoran Desert covers most of the southern half of Arizona and New Mexico. The Sonoran Desert has large sandy plains and bare mountains. Branches of the Colorado River run through it, so many trees, cacti, and shrubs find enough water to grow there. Beautiful flowering cacti and yucca make the desert seem more like a garden than the open sandy place one might imagine. The Chihuahuan Desert is the largest desert in North America. It is approximately 800 miles long and 250 miles wide. Most of the Chihuahuan Desert is in Mexico, in the United States. The desert extends into parts of New Mexico, Texas, and southeastern Arizona. The southwest has vast plains, spectacular canyons, and colorful plateaus. The eastern part of the southwest region is made up of plains, which are areas of flat land. The central plains are the lowest lands in the southwest region. The fertile soil of the central plains spreads from the coast of Texas along the Gulf of Mexico and into central Oklahoma. The central plains are home to many farms and ranches. Farther west, the land rises to form the Colorado Plateau. A plateau is a high, flat landform that rises steeply from the land around it. The Colorado Plateau covers much of northern New Mexico and Arizona. Most of the Colorado Plateau is fairly level, but it is crisscrossed by hundreds of deep canyons. A canyon is a deep, narrow valley with steep sides. The largest and most famous of these canyons is the Grand Canyon. The Colorado River travels south and west mm -hmm. down through some of the driest parts of the country. Then it crosses into Mexico and ends in the Gulf of California. The Colorado River is 1,470 miles long. Many smaller rivers flow into the Colorado. Rivers that join other rivers are called tributaries. Each tributary adds water and soil, called silt, to the Colorado. This silt gives the river its reddish-brown color. The Hoover Dam is one of America's greatest manufactured structures. Hoover Dam was built to control flooding on the Colorado River and to store water. An area where water is stored is called a reservoir. The Hoover Dam was built more than 60 years ago. Lake Mead, the lake behind the Hoover Dam, provides water for many of the people in the southwest region. The Rio Grande River also brings much needed water to the area. The Rio Grande is 1,885 miles long. The Rio Grande begins in the mountains of Colorado and then flows south through the middle of New Mexico. Then it turns southeast, making a big bend along the border of Texas until it empties into the Gulf of Mexico. The Rio Grande forms part of the border between the U.S. and Mexico. In Mexico, the Rio Grande is known as Rio Bravo del Norte.